Ooh, Jubei could play some Onmyoji. Ooh, what's up, what's up, everybody? Yeah, we're playing some Onmyoji. Yeah, well, I've, actually, I play this game. I still been playing every day. Like you can see, I'm I'm at level cap. We've been farming a lot of souls. Uh, we've been farming a lot in general, but still playing this game. Actually, the, there's an auto farm. If you guys maybe picked it up a while ago and put it down after a while, there's an auto farm feature. Might get a few of you back into it. There's an auto farm feature, this little paper doll thing, and it basically, like, the, all the tedious parts of the game, it basically does it for you. You just need to, like, keep it on the side and, like, check in every now and again to, like, keep feeding this little paper doll auto farming feature. We'll talk about that later, but mainly, mainly, I see a lot of people asking how to get gold, I don't have any gold, etc, etc. I thought it'd be nice to do a little, uh, little guide on a few different ways that I used to get gold. I have 4.3 million gold, uh, right now. I had gold problems. I had, I got 99 problems, but gold ain't what? I had gold problems back a while ago, and I don't have them anymore. So I'll go over uh, a few ways how I personally get gold. All right, uh, one of the most important things, these bounty quests, 2,000 gold, 3,000 gold, you can get 100,000 gold a day easily from bounty quests. All you gotta do is farm whatever, it'll show you, like you click on this, it shows you where the location is, Mount Gloom. You just kill these Kamikuis in Mount Gloom, and then you get, I mean, this one's for AP, not gold. But this one's like, the, these two here that we already beat, they give you the gold. I gotta do this in a second, though. Uh, but that's one way, excuse me. Uh, number two, make friends. So, this is more of a, like, pay-to-win style. Actually, you don't have to pay to win this. Uh, you don't have to do this. But if you have friends sending you these daily packs, here's how you do these daily packs. They cost jade if you want to send them, but if you have, if you're very nice to people, they might send you some, and you can get a few different things. You get skill Daruma, experience Daruma, AR amulets, jade, AP, and coins, and a lot of times like, oh rip, I just got coins, but hey man, you get, you keep getting coins over and over and over again. Like, you get coins like 30 times, that's a mil that's almost a million, less. it's what, 30,000, I think it's like 30,000 when you get it. So it'd be like 900,000, okay, 34, 34, and that's already over one whatever million gold. And I I want to send them back, I haven't been opening mine. So I, who knows how much gold we still have waiting, but I want to get some more SJ and then start sending some packs out to the people that sent packs to me. I feel like it's it's fair to, to, to little trades, that's just my, my thing. Uh, but you don't have, like, if people send them to you, you don't have to, you know, spend money on anything. You know, that's people send them to you. And they get, they get stuff, uh, they get, the uh, they get Jade when they send them. So both of you get, uh, both of you get some out of it. Alright. So that's another way. Uh, don't go crazy. Okay, here's another one. Don't go crazy upgrade, crazy upgrading souls unless you need to. If they're not your main, your main units, if they're not main, your main Shikigamis, you don't need to go crazy upgrading their souls. You don't need 5,000 different units and upgrading the souls on 5,000 different things. Focus on your main units and then upgrade the souls for them this way. That's more of a way to not spend a crazy amount of gold than, uh, than to make gold. Uh, if you have a bunch of souls and you're like, oh, I got a bunch of souls I got to feed to things. Instead of that, you can, let me switch to who's, I think Yabakuni is not, uh, her totem is not, yeah. You can feed these, where, where, where we go, enhance, enhance, you could feed all these to there, and they don't cost, uh, this doesn't cost gold to feed, to level up your totem, this does not cost, uh, t cost any gold to do that. So if you got a bunch of runes, uh, runes, souls, runes, ah, fail, if you got a bunch of souls, that you're like, oh, I could level my other souls up, when you level souls up with, with food souls, with the crappy poopy souls, then it costs gold. When you do this, it does not cost gold. So there's, 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 a, there's another thing. Actually, I don't want to keep, I don't want to keep her. I need to get, I need to switch back to him. Okay, I really didn't use her too much. So I kind of like, uh, no, not this guy, not this guy. I kind of like, uh, what's her face? I wanted to do Kagura. No, I wanted to do Kagura more. Anyway, that's besides, we're getting off topic. We're getting off topic. What else? What else? Um, I literally have make friends send receive packs twice on this list. Uh, oh, all timed content. Okay. There's a couple different things that's timed content. Uh, demon counters, great for getting gold. Demon counters right here. You can get gold, you can get jade, you can get all these little, uh, these realm cards, you can get skill rooms, whatever. Not, not difficult to do. A lot of them have like little quiz aspects that you could just go like, 
You can either ask guildmates or whatever. Also, join Bagel Bites. Bagel Bites, one word. Capital B, capital B. Bagel Bites. Join Bagel Bites. That's my guild. We need some new, uh, we need some fresh, but we have like 20 spaces to fill. So, join Bagel Bites. Anyway, uh, do these. Gives you gold. What else? Guild raids as well. Give you guild as well. Let's go to the guild raids. Like I said, Bagel Bites, there we go. Don't look at the dual score in the medals. I have not been as active this week. I'm sorry. Don't look at, don't look at that. Don't look at that. Don't look at that. Uh, these group quests. A company quest is usually the one you really want to go for. Uh, but anytime you do these, these it helps the guild. Plus, you get gold in return as well. So that's pretty cool. And then you can also get these. And you can summon, uh, you can summon some good, potentially good souls from those. Uh, but that'll give you gold as well. A lot of people I notice don't even do those. A lot of people like join the guild and they're like, they don't even do those quests. So even if it's ones like, like some of the, uh, some of the awakening materials, you just have plenty of like the low level awakening materials. I mean, if you can't do the accompany, right? If you don't have the time and you can't manage fitting the, doing the accompany quest into your schedule, at least do, at least do some of those, right? I see a lot of people not even doing that. So there's, th there's that. You can also do Coin Spirit. I don't do Coin Spirit, but people do Coin Spirit. Uh, royal, Royal Battles. Royal, no, this is not the Royal. This is Royal Battles. Royal Battles. Uh, so you can go to, let's go, uh, I'll show you guys the Royal Battles in a second. Well, n not in a second. We'll do, show you guys the Royal Battles. Now. Royal Battles. Uh, so anyway, you do this. You, get, you win, you get some coins. You win here, you get some coins. It's pretty nice. Uh, you can potentially get a lot of coins from that, but even even not winning too much, you still get uh, you still get some coins out of that. Uh, so there's that. Like I said, you can do the coin spirit. Uh, I don't do the coin spirit because I'm lazy, but you can do the coin spirit. You can also use. Where is this guy? This guy, Tesso, is gonna be kind of nice for you. Tesso's got this. This he this is his awakened one. This is his awakened one. Um. No, not this one. Not this one. Uh, you need money. Tesso has a 40% chance of decreasing... Oh, not that part. Winning a battle with Tesso deployed grants an 8% coin bonus. Okay, so if you have him in the battle, you get extra coins with him already. He's He needs to be awakened for that, though, so keep that in mind. He doesn't need to be... You don't need to six, like, uh, G6 him or anything, but you do need to actually... You do need to, to at least awaken him. But he's not that, he's not that difficult to awaken. Uh, what else? Gold boosters, if you go up here... There's boosters here. Here's a gold booster here, but there's uh, there's other ones as well. But there are gold boosters. You can get extra gold by using those gold boosters. Uh, far oh, yeah, farming. Just farming. Farming, farming, farming. So let's go to, I guess we're over here. Let's go... Yeah, you can just get, you can get gold from doing that. And let's see this paper doll thing. So this paper doll, if you guys don't know, I mean, you feed the paper doll here and then he he has his energy and then you can just click auto and ah uh, we have we were maxed on souls right you click auto and he'll go through and he'll do his thing but these little gold up things they give you more gold and you just farm you just farm and even if the, if the paper doll is just farming for you there you go even if you're feeding him gold and ap he still you still get more out of it uh anyway okay so we got that dailies and achievements your quests just do your quest. You get 1,000 gold here, 500 gold. It's not a crazy amount of gold. It's a little bit, though, and every little bit helps. Uh, achievements, this one gives you 10,000, 10,000. So we got uh, we got some achievements that'll give you some gold. This is not a really a reliable thing. You can only do these once. But may as well see if you could, uh, you know, achieve any of these and get, like, a quick little boost of gold. That's just, like, a one-time thing, though. Uh, release souls, you can do that. Let's go show you guys release and boy do we need to don't look at his souls are terrible Don't look at his souls are terrible Uh, what are we doing? What are we doing? Release. Let's release. Okay, so we can release a lot of these souls Six thousand six thousand so actually I didn't upgrade any uh, So I didn't even see if we could make him better for quite a while But we can keep we can go through and we have all these two-star ones right because we have them uh, sorted So we see the two-star ones first uh, or the the G2 ones first. We got 28 here. It's 56 uh 5600 gold. So there you go. So we get that and we get the gold. If you release the good ones, if you release the G6 ones, you get uh, some Orochi scales. So that's cool. Uh what else? What else? What else? What else? 
6,000. Oh my god. Oh my god. Do we even have... Do we even have... No, I want to see. I want to see. We don't even have... That crit, though. Oh, we have some, we have some five-star crit options now. Okay. At least that's... At least that's better. We don't have a... We still don't have... 6,000 souls? I don't even have a, a G6 crit soul? Fails at life. Fails at life. How to fail at life 101. Alright, so we got... We got those. Also, we have a couple... We only have two more. Okay. Uh, two more that I... That I have in the list. I'm sorry if I didn't include... And you can include... Feel free to include some stuff in the comments below, guys. Feel free to include some stuff in the comments below. We have these realm cards. Some of these will give you, let's see, do we have any that give you gold? None that give, we have, it, we have to fuse a lot of these together. Okay, but some of these, like, you see the, you see, like, this one gives you extra AP, this one gives you a uh, random reward. Some of these give you gold, so we gotta, we don't, we don't have any, but some of them give you gold. So, placing the realm cards, also, a lot of you guys put these, these, these one stars in here. I don't ever use any 1 stars, I don't ever use any 2 stars, I try to not even use any 3 stars. I just fuse all these up until we get something not terrible. Because you don't have time to use all of them anyway, so uh, we gotta keep fusing those. Anyway, but there are some that give you gold. And then the last, last but not least, you can go and you can actually just buy gold. Uh, at the mall. Right? General store. I mean, you could buy it, but it's not. I mean, you could buy with with Jade, but that, I don't want. I don't want to ever use Jade to buy gold because you get gold by playing the game. So just play the game more. Honestly, just play the. It's it's more just play the game. Gold is a byproduct of how much you actually play. So play the game more, and you get more gold. But hopefully, maybe some of you guys didn't know like one of these, one or two of these things. You're like, oh, I didn't think of that. Oh, I didn't know the guild thing. Oh, I've been not using this thing or or that thing. Maybe it helps you. Uh, hope it does, but that's what I've been doing to, uh, to get gold. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. That's it for this one. I will see you, as always, in the next one after I sort these 6,000 souls and feed 5,950 of them.